Hey everyone, my name is David Sauter. I am a certified personal trainer with NASM, and I'm here today with Life Sprout Bioceuticals to talk about rest breaks and resting time. How long should you rest? A new study has just come out confirming that longer rest breaks result in more strength and more muscle mass. Now, functional training is a necessity, especially if you want to maintain independence well into old age. And with this new discovery, this is great news because it allows you the resting time to properly adapt to the exercise without overdoing it, without putting yourself at risk for injury or uh, exacerbating any kind of medical condition. So the time is up to three minutes. The study found that breaks that lasted no longer than three minutes were superior, superior to those that lasted only a minute or less. So today I'm going to run you through a quick setup of how you can use this in your own exercises. Now keep in mind, when you take your rest break, you are not just sitting down. You have to be moving. You have to be walking in place. You have to be walking around in a circle. You cannot just sit down and let your heart rate come all the way back down. This is really important. So how can we apply this? First, let's say we take the dumbbell bench press. So you have your dumbbells, set yourself up, come down to the bench, and then you would perform 12 repetitions. Once you hit 12, stop, put your dumbbells down, come up, and the break begins. So you can march in place, you can do some body weight squats to get your heart rate up. Just do not do this. Do not just sit down. If you're out of breath, of course, take a seat, get your breath back, and then get right back up again. You do not want your heart rate to come all the way back down to the same level it is when you're just sitting around on the couch. After your break, you go into the next exercise, and we do side to side twists. One, two, three. Again, do 12 repetitions. Put your dumbbell down. Right back to marching in place for up to three minutes. You can have a break that is shorter than three minutes, but do not exceed three minutes. Okay, so I am David Sauter, certified personal trainer with NASM. I hope you enjoyed this video. Take care.